Welcome to the Practical Animal Channel with me, John Beaumont. Today I want to talk about molting in birds of prey. It's late April and this bird of prey, a Harris's hawk, has been molting for approximately one month. Every morning I find long feathers in her, coming from her muse or on the ground when she's put out to weather. And you can just see for the first time, bearing in mind the month the molt has been going for a month, I can just see the first feather starting to emerge in the centre of her tail. Can you see that right in the centre of the picture? That's one month since she has started molting. For people who train birds of prey and fly them, falconers, we're interested in the molt being as quick as possible and that usually means three to four months if we're lucky and we're interested in all the main feathers that you can see in the picture so the primaries at the end of the wing the secondaries in the middle part of the wing and the tail or train the feather that is just starting to emerge looks like a dart for want of a better expression there was something on social media recently about uh, featuring a photograph of a red kite that looked like it had been darted with a crossbow but in fact it was a feather still in the shaft the shaft is the membrane at the bottom of the feather still and we say the feather is still in the blood hope you've enjoyed this video there you are you can see the feather perfectly now She's still feeding. We'll let her go with it. Hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please press like. And if you want more content on wildlife, nature, and the animal industry, please subscribe to the channel. Next video will be on behavior of nestling birds of prey. Thank you.